I'm Pastor George Borkart, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. Asc Ascension Day. That's the subject of today's Higher Things Video Short. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, donate. If you love our videos, if you love what we're doing, pass on the faith to the next generation. Like our videos, subscribe to our channel, ring the bell for notifications, and donate. Your tax-deductible gift won't wake the dog up, but it will help higher things. A youth organization that does summer conferences is probably hurting during COVID-19. Give today. All right. Today is the celebration of our Lord's ascension. So I want to take a look at Mark 16, verses um, 19 and 20. Um, and so the Lord when he had said these things, was taken up into heaven and sat down on the, uh, out, on the right of the throne, a uh, 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 right hand of God, Dexios. And they went out preaching everywhere while the Lord worked with them and confirmed the message by uh, signs that followed. Amen. This is a big deal. This is Christmas Easter big, and nobody cares about it. It's in the creed. That makes it a big deal. It's in the scriptures. Everything in the scriptures is a big deal. But the ramifications for this, huge. God, God's right-hand man is Jesus. After he had won your salvation with his holy life and bitter sufferings and death, after he'd risen from the dead and conquered your sin and death, he was crucified for our sins. He was raised for our justification. After he showed himself alive to his apostles and sent them to preach the gospel to all creation, he was taken up into heaven to the very right hand of God. Right hand, top spot. That's where Jesus is. God's right hand has a man. Jesus, our Savior. Man with God is on the throne. We'll get to that. To the very right hand of God is man. How could God not be for us forever now? On his right side is his son. The man, Jesus. How can God not save us? The one with the nail-scarred hands is on his right side. How can God not be good to us? The advocate, our defense attorney, the one who is most pro-us, is whispering in his ear, I died for that sin. That sin right there. I died for that one. That sin right there. I died for that one. You know what? You want to look at him, God? You're going to have to look at him through my nail-scarred hands. Don't look at him apart from my nail-scarred hands. This is huge because there's no end of good that God does, that Jesus does, from the very right hand of God. For us, he's there. For our salvation, he's there. Our advocate, friend, defender, right there at the top spot, that's Jesus. With Jesus at God's right hand, God is always working out things for your good. With Jesus at God's right hand, everything's always going to turn out for your good. He makes evil good. He turns bad into happy. He works everything out for your good. How could you not believe that? Man is at God's right hand. Our Elijah, our Aaron, has taken a seat, and that seat is at the power, uh, in the power and the glory of God. What I mean by that is this hymn, my favorite hymn, stanza five of hymn number 494 in LSB. He has raised our human nature on the clouds to God's right hand. There we sit in heavenly places. There with him in glory stand. 
Jesus reigns adored by angel. Man with God is on the throne. By our mighty Lord's ascension, we by faith behold our own. He's there. A man is there. Our Jesus is there. That means everything's going to be okay. Whether the sun comes up tomorrow, whether a virus gets us, whether cancer gets us, whether we lose all our friends and our family, it's going to be okay no matter what happens. Because God, at God's right hand, is our Savior Jesus. Everything is going to be just fine. Better than fine. It's going to be ascension. I'm Pastor George Borkart, a blessed ascension to you and your family. And this has been another Higher Things video short.